good early morning. We're so glad you're here. Be daily vlog, so if you like this video, Starting off our Sunday, I went on a run, four miles. Yep, and foot hurts. Vlog. Um, we do have to talk about your running. We never did I yesterday, know. Um, but we are going to 9:30 mass at our new church, which is different than the mass we went to last week. And this week, there's like the children's choir, and it's more like a little family oriented. Right? It is like I know it's it'll, a little torturous. <laughs> a little torturous, but, but we love it. We love it, and so. Um, Sometimes you gotta like smile through the tears, you know. Yeah, but it's gonna be a good, a good day. I just love all the singing, and that's yeah. why we love the little kids' choirs. Yeah. Look at this beautiful, sunny it's a Park Avenue. Day in the neighborhood. All right, so we were wrong. Um, there was definitely lots of little kids there, but it was not a children's yeah. choir. I just love when all the kids like go to the the children's um, liturgy. liturgy. And they're all like, <laughs> they're all like, and then they come out. They're like, a little bit of worry, a little bit of like, <laughs> yeah, like I don't know where I'm going. Where, who did I come with? Where am I going? <laughs> yeah, love that. It's a good mess. Uh, yeah, good mess. We it's so like this is only the second time, so we're still like seeing priests for the first time. Mm -hmm. And there's a priest there who definitely looks like our friend Gareth. Yes. And it's funny, I just like, can't picture Gareth being a priest, but I'm looking at him as a priest. Uh -huh. They look very similar. And then they have a very like American accent, so yeah. it's like, that's they not, open their mouth and say, like, that's Gareth. not Gareth. <laughs> but it's so much like yeah. him. But so good. Now yeah. we gotta go home and get to getting. Mm -hmm. It's 11.50. So there's export in the vlog now. We're getting a proper hearty, hearty, hearty. Hearty, har, har. Hearty, har, har. <laughs> vegan lunch getting going on. We got quinoa here. We're gonna... We're like sauteing some garlic and soy sauce with some black beans and garbanzos. All that seasoning. Soon we're going to add some spinach leaves in there. We have to go grocery shopping. That is the biggest thing I would say, like being plant-based, is you have to go grocery shopping more often because the food is more fresh. Yeah. And so, uh, yeah. like veggies go bad, things like go... We get free stuff, but I'm, that gives me the heat of jeeves. <laughs> yeah. Oh, a lot of people have been asking what kind of cooking we were use, and it's called Good Full. And what's cool about it is it's ceramic. It's not like your traditional nonstick. Um, so a lot of times with nonstick, there's like a risk of like chemicals in your food and whatnot, and like the ceramic. Stops. More hoodoo voodoo. Yeah, like I literally like as like we've been trying to eliminate toxins from our life. One of the big things was like using a Teflon pan, um, and so we got these, and they're incredible. Yeah, it's what well, one. Whether the science is there or not, like it's just good to take that step, the precaution, because yeah. who knows? And it's super easy to clean and it's super great. The only thing I'm starting to realize is on the edges, because we stack them kind of, I'm seeing a, beginning to see a little bit of like dings, but I think that's fine. I think that's yeah. just normal wear. We should get like racks. Yeah. I think. All right, it is cooler today, which is why I'm wearing this outfit, and I'm also partially wearing this outfit because the Earhart's went to Raglan Road, and I know they're rocking good old fashioned Irish, Irish attire. We just said, like, we don't know the last time we saw them in the daylight. <laughs> kind of like, nervous. We typically see them like after work, or like, you know, their vacation isn't always over a weekend, so we are excited. It smells like onions. But we don't know if they are, they were finishing their Raglan Road lunch, or brunch, they were gonna hit up the gift shop before they hit up World of Disney. So we actually don't know where they're at, but we are going to find them. Look at these Irish girlies. And an Irish, oh, he's got his Legos ready. Even mom is all. Hi. Ben, so we fit right in. Oh, yeah. yeah, where? Oh, okay. We're in World of Disney now. Um, I don't condone this, but I just stole the Earhart's child. Wow! <laughs> Who wore it better? You need a flag. Who wore it better? This is called Vacationing at Disney Springs with the Air Hearts. This is a great angle for us. I don't think I told the vlog. I wore this outfit for you. I, w I wasn't even gonna wear the hat until you sent the picture. Oh, wow. And then it was a had the sweater. Well, your son has my sunglasses, so I can't do that. If you dress like this, you can walk through Rag on the Road like you own the place. Because we do own the place. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, Sarah's going with the Earhart clan into the minivans. I'm gonna take the car because I have the car. 
and all the we picked up some groceries from Publix for the Earhart's before we came over so we need to bring that to the boardwalk but the most exciting part about this drive Ben gave me his magic band so I can just swipe into the boardwalk and I don't have to talk to security I love that because it always extra makes me feel like I'm just on vacation here in Walt Disney World Resort So sweet. They had to know if they were gonna get me access to the room before they got here that I was gonna put Stacy on. Alive and well. Yes. The girls are just chilling. Karen's putting his Lego together. Uh, ben and I are just grumpy old men talking about politics. And eating candy. And eating candy, you're right. All we wanted to get her was trying to get her to get her walking. She just walked almost to the table. Are you my friend yet? Cheese bugs! <laughs> this is a monumental moment. Cordelia hasn't fallen in love with the book arts yet. No. Sarah's got her in now, I think. She really smiled at me earlier. <gasps> this is Frozen 2. Is on the TV? No, it's on public. Katrina, you tricked me. I thought that was on the TV. Look at us. Last time we had our matching illuminations, I have the same Raglan Road. I should have worn it today. But now, they heard got this for me. I literally said, like, how long ago was I? I was like, that is so cute. You it said was, that like, so two... long ago. No, <laughs> it was like two hours ago. And then all of a sudden, now I have it. Like magic, uh -huh. it appeared. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I haven't had a new Disney swag in a long time. These are really comfy. They are. And they have I so many different kinds. So many. They had a Star Wars kind that has an at at. Remember oh, that? Oh, yeah. Yours is more like a shirt. What is, or is yours sweatshirt? Oh, I guess I it is sweatshirt. I want yeah. them to listen to the Show Yourself song. Oh, okay. okay. Let's Just listen think. to Show also, Yourself. Also, I want a tattoo well, of this. Nice. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Is that the tattoo you're getting too? We might need cheese pizza tonight. Oh, We're still so thinking about it. <laughs> I don't know. Cornelia's like. Oh! I had my adventure. I told you something new. I am afraid when I'm risking the gun of you. Where? It's the. Oh. No! <laughs> today at all. No, we're at Hollywood Studios now and the big kids and their parents and their grandparents are on Slinky Dog and we got the two little ones. Peter never? I've never seen that before. <laughs> okay, <laughs> up up top there's uh, the toy box, then there's Buzz. I've not, he's controlling the, the game. The Buzz, like you In the control the tower and then there's a Greetings. toy soldier up there too. Peter never saw any of it. Hi! Come on over! Go, go, go! go. You got it! Dog case idea. <laughs> <laughs> Katrina's her name Hi, and off is her game. Hi! Here comes Woody and Mo! Hi! And Mo Pee Mo, my gosh! We got an awesome spot of fireworks. Let's take a look inside the theater. Tonight is about famine. We 
got a really good spot, really last minute. We just five strolled minutes. up. But well, we got it for the pre-show. Yeah, but we're five minutes away from the Star Wars, the Galactic Spectacular. I'm nervous, I didn't realize, I don't know if they had anything for the Rise of Skywalker, but they might have. Ben did a thing. I forgot you guys collected this. Wait, I turned it off. Can you hit the button? I didn't know this until Ben just got this butt. Ooh, Whoa. it lights up. Oh, yeah. Kieran didn't even see it yet. You like that, dude? <laughs> Everyone took a bathroom break, so we're all playing with Sarah and I. We're playing with Kaylee. A goofball. <laughs> Where's Sarah? <laughs> jump in, jump out. Turn yourself around. I said jump in, jump out. Introduce yourself. My name is Kaylee. Thank <laughs> <laughs> you. All right, it's extra magic hours. We heard a report that there's some really cute Princess Leia plush here. And we're gonna check it out. Right, Katrina? Yup. Yup. There we go, this is it. Oh, Leia! So cute. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, there's a bunch of them. And Chewy? Oh no, this is trouble. This is the gold, what is it? Gold Squadron Striker Express? Gold it's Miller Lite. No, I'm just saying. <laughs> Basically. It has floral undertones. Yes. And this is some fancy super space age name. It's yummy. We're on our way out. Well, I still think like, that was amazing. But we are walking through the stores for warmth. This is the first bit of Easter I have seen. All right. We have a pretty big thing that's about to happen. Yeah. Sarah and I have made a very conscious decision that we, contrary to what you may have seen in a previous vlog very recently about the Earhart's trying to break us, mm -hmm. Sarah and I have actually been talking about this for a couple Quite weeks now. Yeah. We've talked it over with um, our doctors, the president, senators, all the proper parties, and I'm going to grow as a human in a responsible, self-controlled fashion. Yes, and, and what why? that means is that we are going to remain plant-based, primarily, but if we see something that we want, we will eat it, and it's okay. From the get-go, our friend Lauren has been like this for years now, yeah. where she's basically like 95% vegetarian, but sometimes she has fish, sometimes she has cheese, sometimes, mm -hmm. but for the most part, she doesn't have any of those things. Yeah. But every once in a while, she's like, you whatever, I just want it. Yeah. And, and that's better. we're in charge of our own selves. And so this had been going on prior to, it was just brought up, and I think that that's why it was, you know, on the vlog, but we are making this decision ourselves. The Earhart's here, even here, and the thing about this is, Sarah's been kind of... We, jonesing? Jonesing, but like, we've talked about this for almost like, I'd say months now, and Sarah's always been, we can do it where we make the rules, and if we want cheese pizza every once in a while, or we want corned beef on St. Patrick's Day, like, we can do whatever we want. And I've been the stickler that's been like, I don't have the self-control to say that very few often, because I'm going to go off the rail and have a bunch of cheese every single day and all this meat for the next 16 days straight and that's where I say like I need to grow as an adult and just learn that self-control so that's what we're gonna do and I told Sarah earlier when we were joking around about doing this today I was like you know what we need to because I'm never gonna learn if we don't give me the chance to learn to have that self-control so, so we are going to order a cheese pizza from the pizza window at Boardwalk which we've also never had before it is time <laughs> 10 months, no cheese, coming to an end. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot of things. We could take some home. We could or we could not. Yeah. We know we're probably gonna get sick. <laughs> yeah, so I might as well like do it up, you know? 
Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go. Together? Yeah. Ten months, no cheese or meat. Ends right now. Yeah, I've, there was a little bit more sauce. We've heard, we've actually never, like we said, we never had that pizza window before, and we've heard, I honestly think, I've heard maybe 50 different reviews over the years of coming here and working here, and it's been like 50-50 on what people think of that window. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. I'm full. We ate <laughs> that whole pizza. And that's that. And that's <laughs> that. Okay, what a day, we are home. The quote today is, nothing in the world can bother you as much as your own mind, I tell you. In fact, others seem to be bothering you, but it is not others, it is your own mind. Sri Sri Ravi Shankar. I kind of feel like we're doing this injustice by doing it right as a sign off, but we didn't talk about my running again. Oh gosh. But we need to right now. I ran four miles today, my foot hurts still. Wait, that was today? Yeah. I ran four miles this morning, first run in like almost 10 days, because my right foot is still weird. It's still hurt, but it feels fine now, but I can still feel feels weird. I should really go to the doctor and get it checked out, but I just don't want to right now. But I really do feel like there's a stress fracture more than the tendonitis. Am I like pink? I feel like I'm flush. I feel warm. You got a, um, a fever? You got a fever? Mm -hmm. But we found out on Friday, this is how long we've been trying to tell you guys. We found out on Friday when they released the waivers for Princess Weekend that because I got to use my wine and dine half marathon time of an hour 48, I have been, I'm so honored. <laughs> they put me in corral A for all of Princess, well at least the 10K and half marathon. Yeah. I presume it'll be A for the 5K, but they haven't released that, but because I'm doing the challenge for 10 and half, They've released the corral assignments for that, and I will be in corral A. Cannot believe it. I can. I just got to make sure my foot is feeling good, and that my legs feel good, and then I get back to the running regularly. Yeah, you will. But I have to take care of my foot. You do. Mm -hmm. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.